46 minutes after the hour, time to take a look at some of the stories that are trending in your social media feeds this morning in the entertainment world. And Paula Froelich is here with the scoop. So let's talk about Garth Brooks. I love Garth Brooks. Say it. Me is. too. So um, he's been accused uh, by a makeup artist of sexual assault, but he said, yeah. no, this is not true. It was a jaw dropper. Now, in order to talk about this story, I do think we have to go through the timeline because this makeup artist did start working with his wife, Trisha in 1999. Trisha Yearwood. Exactly. So she has known this family for over two decades. In 2017, she became Garth's personal makeup person. And, you know, he does it. She travels with him. And then in 2019, she said, you know what? I'm a little broke. And that's when she says the problem started. And it became really bad after they flew to L.A. to, fly, to film a thing for the Grammys. And she says he only booked one room, and he raped her. And she said he she couldn't do anything because she's broke. Oh and gosh. so and kept working for him. She says is that right? And kept working for him, and then apparently it got worse. You know, there was a lot of like, oops, look at me, I'm not wearing any clothes. You know how these things happen. And <laughs> yes. I don't know how these uh, things I mean, happen. I suppose. <laughs> and so anyway, she's saying, listen, I tried to sue her a month ago for harassment and trying to extort this crazy money out of me. And he did it under John Doe. Because okay. he says, I didn't want anyone's families out there. We all have families. And then literally this week, she said, uh, no, I'm going to put my name on it. Boom. And sued him. And now her lawyer's saying this. I'm going to read this out. It's a, her lawyer says, I cannot get into settlement discussions, but the suggestion made by Garth Brooks that he was unwilling to pay millions is simply not true. It seems as though Sean Combs and Garth Brooks are using the same public relations team by attacking legitimate business, uh, le you know, legitimate victims. And you're just going, oh, my God. You know, so I think this was the threat that they were saying, hey, pay out or we're going to go public. Yeah. And it's not a good time to go public right now. All right, let's move on to this. On your YouTube mm -hmm. show, The Scoop, you interviewed uh, Derek Parker. He's known as a pop cop, right? And you Hello. asked him whether you, he thinks that Sean Diddy uh -huh. Holmes is going to be giving away some names in order to get a plea deal. So let's watch that. Oh, show. yeah. I think anybody will rat if they're getting put into a certain position. Where you're looking at R. Kelly time, R. Kelly's doing 20 to 30 years on two separate cases in jail. <laughs> <laughs> and look what happened. And you look what happened to R. Kelly. And that was only two cases. Now that he's was got two it. cases, right? He's got he's multiple. He's got like a hundred. And the problem you have too is the outcry of all these witnesses. It's hard for a jury, I think, mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. listen to all these people come forward if the government presents them to to give a positive verdict where he gets acquitted. That's going to be very difficult. You've mm -hmm. been an entertainment reporter for a long time. Do you think Diddy's famous friends have been staying silent? They <laughs> I think they've been staying awake and freaking out and ripping on their nails at night. That's what I think. You know, you have a lot of reporting about Kevin Hart, who had videos of himself next to a, ba a bathtub with naked women in it at these parties. And, you know, that's been uncovered. Yes, it's insane. I missed that. It is, it is insane, and then you've got a lot of talk of LeBron James and other really big names, and don't date Jay-Z. That's all I got to ask. All right. Well, we will continue following it, mm -hmm. we know you'll be the one on it for us. Thank you so much, Paula Froelich. Got it. And be sure to subscribe to her newsletter. It's called The Scoop. You'll get the biggest stories and entertainment delivered to your inbox. Make sure you do that, scanning the QR code on your screen. More Morning in America on the other side of the break. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.